All right, y'all, so I'm just gonna do a quick video. Uh, this is gonna be a real quick one, just to show y'all the strawberries have been turning red, right? As you can see, they're all nice and red inside of there. I didn't expect them to get red this quick. So, but I'm gonna show you something. So I had put this, this bird netting around it. Could you see the one down there on the ground? Look at that. The birds did that. The birds, uh, the birds went into it and uh, started pecking, start pecking my strawberries. So we had that little bird feeder in the backyard. I'm gonna go ahead and move the, back, the bird feeder from the backyard. But you can see the strawberries are getting red. And even the one on the ground, the ones on the ground. Back here are starting to ripen. So I got this bird netting across everything. Like I said, I'm not trying to feed the, uh, I'm not trying to feed the birds, okay? As far as my strawberries. But that's the second one we found, like a hole in it. The birds, actually the one on the ground over there, he pecked that one too. So they been, they come in and peck a whole hole in them. So what I did, this netting right here, I just put it around the plant and hopefully that'll keep them out where they can't reach my strawberries and the rest of them can grow. I told you it's upsetting to watch a bird come in and take care, t take over your, uh, you know, kill your, eat your strawberries. You did all that work planting and everything, waiting for them to come up and then here come the birds, they just come eat it up. So I just put a little stop to that. Anyway, so you can see, looking at the garden now, look how big tall the tomatoes got. I told you once I put that, uh, that, that grass around it, Everything is starting to take off again. You know, even the uh, eggplant over here. It's got some flowers on it now. And these peppers are now starting to get a little life in them. Yesterday, I came out here and I sprayed them with neem oil because I got damage on my leaves. Look at this. Shallow little holes. But now it's doing better. Today, let me see what caused it. They got these little teeny black bugs that'll be on your. They they they, they attack the peppers and they attack these. Uh, they love the leaves of the uh, eggplants. And they, they was actually attacking that one too. But now today, the plants are doing a lot better. So I came down here last night and I just sprayed everything down with neem oil. And also, y'all, my carrots are coming up. See? My carrots are coming up. I got a row of carrots right here. So now I know exactly what they are. And these are the carrots. I sprayed the, the kale down. I might have to come back in here one day and weed. Because, you know, you can see all the grass and everything that's growing up in here. But I wanted to make sure first I wanted to make sure first that I that I got my um, that I, my plants come up so I know I can identify them. I can't believe this. This is actually eggplants. <laughs> also, look at this, y'all. These are see this right here. Um, right there. This right here is a baby eggplant. Here's another one. I'm just realizing my backyard is full of baby eggplants. A lot of them have fell, the, the seeds fell on the ground. Like here's another right here. So the, and these came up on their own. I did not plant these. The yard is full of them. There's one right there. There's some over back over here. Cause I had egg plants in the garden yesterday, last year and they fell to the ground. So they came up on their own. That's the first time I ever had egg plants actually come up like that. All right. I, had, I got water, I got one watermelon in the front yard that came up, and y'all can see the growth in the um, 
these are the, the snap beads. You can see they actually got a lot taller since last video. They're actually a lot taller. And now you can clearly see some of the spinach just kind of popping up. All right. So this was a quick video. Basically, I just wanted to really show you this, my strawberries, how these birds were coming in and pecking my strawberries. And there was some nice sized strawberries in there. I don't, I don't want the birds to get up. See, I got strawberries going all over, all over the yard. I even got them growing in the front yard. They're hanging on the side of the plant down here. As you can see back under here, I have strawberries. Strawberries on the ground, strawberries in this pot. So I do not want the birds to get my strawberries. All right, y'all. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Uh -huh.